Do fire sprinklers all go off at once? Myth-busting guide. Ever seen this in the movies? A single fire sets off every sprinkler in the building. But is that how fire sprinklers actually work? Let's bust this myth. In Hollywood, fire sprinklers are shown as these dramatic all-or-nothing systems. One flame, and suddenly the entire place looks like a water park. But here's the truth. This is not how fire sprinkler systems actually operate. Fire sprinklers are designed to work independently. Each sprinkler head contains a heat-sensitive element, like a glass bulb or a fusible link. When the temperature near that head reaches a certain point, usually around 155 degrees to 165 degrees, the element breaks or melts, activating only that sprinkler head. So, if there's a fire in one part of a building, only the sprinklers closest to the fire will activate. This is a targeted system designed to control the fire while minimizing water damage. The idea of all sprinklers going off at once likely comes from Hollywood's need for drama. It's more visually exciting but completely unrealistic. If every sprinkler activated at once, you'd have unnecessary water damage and the fire might not even be in all those areas. There are systems where water is discharged everywhere, but those are called deluge systems. These are typically found in high-risk areas like chemical plants or aircraft hangars. But in most buildings, residential or commercial, you'll find standard sprinkler systems that activate individually. Now you know the truth about fire sprinklers. If you enjoyed learning something new today, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and share it with your friends. Let's keep busting fire safety myths together.